Welcome to Suffolk County Music Services' presentation of the Greatest Showman Medley Part 2. In this lesson, we're going to practice what we learned last time and then learn how to sing and play This Is Me. So let's get ready to sing and play and we'll start by singing This Is Me. Hello, it's Mr Tabor again. Remember to set your instrument up carefully, warm up with some long notes and to play with good posture throughout your practice sessions. This week, the second instrumental section is made up of two rhythms. Both these rhythms are very similar to each other. The first one ends with a long sound whilst the second one ends with a short sound. We're going to play the one ending with a long sound. Copy me clapping and playing each bar of the rhythm using my mouthpiece and then my instrument. On the instrument we will use the notes E and F sharp this week. Remember E is your first and second valve or fourth position and F sharp is your second valve or second position. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four. Three, four. One, two, 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 three. Now it's time to copy the second of this week's rhythms. As I said earlier, it is very similar to the first one, but in this second one, the last note, the third note of the rhythm, is very short. You will notice it has a dot underneath called a staccato. This means we played very short. Copy me clapping and playing on my mouthpiece and the notes E and F sharp as we learn this second rhythm. One, two, three, four. 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 You can pause the video as many times as you wish in order to practice the two rhythms. 
Once you are happy you can play them both, you are ready to move on. Here's the note guide which shows you how to play all the notes you need for every instrumental section of this piece. Remember that you can pause and rewind the video at any point to come back to this if you need a reminder on how to play the notes. Do you remember what we learnt last session? We learnt to play the first instrumental section and then we sung Rewrite the Stars. Here's a quick recap. Now we're going to learn the second instrumental section. If you look carefully at the very last note, you will see that it has a small dot underneath it. This is known as a staccato dot and it means that you need to play this note short. This section follows on directly from what you learnt last session. Your cue to start playing is two cymbal crashes which you will hear on the backing track. Listen and watch on the first time through, then you can have a go. Now you can have a go. Let's put together everything we've done in session two. We're going to play the second instrumental section and then we're going to sing This Is Me. Are you ready? Well done everyone, you've done a great job listening to each tutor and you've taken the time to pause and practice along the way. Remember, you can watch any part of this video as many times as you'd like to help you practice the piece at home. So keep up the good work and look out for The Greatest Showman Part 3 coming soon.